Hey guys, I am currently in my daughter Maya's room and I just wanted to share with you that we, Ben and I invested in a new system because, well, I'll, I'll tell you a little bit about it. So I'm going to back up. In our last house, we had something called a Venmar, which is a full home in-house, like, air exchanger. Air exchanger. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And we had that. We used it all the time. We ran it all the time. It was really good for people it's with like, allergies. It's, it's like HEPA certified. It's, yeah. it's, it's a true air cleaner. Right. So it, it was quite a uh, necessary part of being in that home with yeah. the dog and everything and all of our allergies. And since being in this house, it's only been a couple of weeks, but my lungs, they hurt um, Keegan's had runny nose, sniffy nose, Maya's got Maya's stuffy nose, yep. you know, Keegan's been sneezing and coughing and our allergies are just going crazy. I know Nola has been complaining about allergies as well. So our allergies have been bad and we knew that we had looked into it before that you can install a Venmar system in an existing house. It doesn't have to be a brand new construction. You can actually have them installed after the fact. So we were looking into it. It's a sizable investment to have it installed and... Mm -hmm to have, you know, to purchase the unit. And, and Venmar is a name brand. I mean, we're, you could also have, um, there's one that starts with a B out there that's actually more local to this area, like a brain or, or a Brino or I, I don't know, the name is a brain. It's like a brain. No, it, it, they're just whole, they're whole home air exchangers for clean air inside your house. Uh, that's one of the most um, frequented areas where air gets stale because there's not a lot of movement. Your furnace can only do so much. Your air conditioner can only do much, so much. And it's mainly just circulating a lot of air throughout the house. It doesn't actually do a great job of bringing fresh air in and getting the bad air out or the old air out. Well, that's what the Venmar does. Though. That's what the Venmar does. Yeah. That's what an air exchanger does, but that's not your furnace and your air conditioner yeah. don't really do that. So we were planning on doing an air exchanger in this house. Uh, we were looking into it, um, and I was I was getting a little cringy at the numbers. Um, but we, our, we, yeah, my our, friend, our, our friend came through with with this solution. So yeah, you... so Christy, my friend Christy, she said to me because I was talking about how my allergies were bad because she was yeah. asking how the new house was, and I said, well, my allergies are kind of not so great. And I told her that we were looking into doing another Venmar, and she said, well. Do you mind if I show you something before you invest in the Venmar? Can I, yeah. I just want to show it to you. You don't have to get it, but I just I just want to show it to you. I think you might really like it. And she said it's really good for people with allergies. In fact, it's allergy certified and it does, well, more than a Venmar does. So she wanted to give us, to kind of show us what the unit looked like, what it did, what it was capable of, and give us another option instead of just the Venmar. So, yep. and, uh... Well, <clears throat> we, uh, once we saw this thing, it was, I wouldn't let her leave without leaving the unit behind because, yeah, yeah. So let's just show you what this thing does. It's not just an air filtration system. It does a whole lot more. So mom, I know you'll appreciate this. It felt like while she was showing this thing, it felt like one of those info commercials where they said, they say, but wait, there's, there's more. more. Yeah. So. Every time she showed us something more, that was the line that kept going through my head. I'm like, holy cow, yeah, you're not leaving this house without leaving that thing behind. So, anyway, let's just show you what we got. All right, guys, so here is a comparison. So many, many years ago, it was just Nola and I, and I purchased the Kirby that you see with Ben right there. That is a Kirby G-Series, G the ultimate i think g series sure. uh diamond edition so anyway yeah. it was a i think one of the high-end kirby whatever it was what, he, what the guy was selling he came to it my house stuff. and it sucks stuff up but it sucks stuff up really well and he did show me some demonstrations he showed me how well it sucked um up the different things and with my allergies i really wanted it because yeah. you can get the filters for it you can yeah. have and it's supposed to do be really good for those with allergies because it does such a really good job it doesn't tear up your carpet um, the, some of the other ones I just won't mention are really good at tearing up your carpet and Kirby is not supposed to do that. So anyway, I fell in love with the Kirby and I have used it ever since I've refused to get rid of it. And 
Um, but there's one thing I have noticed with this Kirby, and every time you use it, and I'm sure anybody else who has a vacuum or a Kirby or anything else will notice any this. Gonna do it. Any vacuum, when you turn it on, you can smell stuff from the vacuum. It smells yeah. dusty. It smells like there's stuff in the air. That's all the stuff that's coming through the filters, by the way. That's that's yeah. just stuff that's coming through the bag and out of the bag. And Yep, and it makes me cough like crazy. Yeah. So it might get the stuff out of the floor, but I feel like it's tossing some of the stuff back into the air because I would cough like crazy every time I used it. So it was yeah. kind of like a, well, I'm using it because it's supposed to be really good, but at the same time, I know that it's throwing stuff in the air, but that, that to me is just, well, that's what all vacuums do. They throw stuff back into the air. Yeah. So. Yeah. And this is why, we're, okay, so this is why we're talking about vacuum cleaners. We went from air exchangers <laughs> yeah. to vacuum cleaners. We're, stick with us. There's a point we're talking about <laughs> one and the other. Right. Okay. <laughs> so this little system down here. This little R2-D2 unit. Yep. Is a rainbow SF. No, SRX. SRX. <laughs> SRX. There's something that I know that's F SFX. I yes. don't know what it is, but SRX. This is a rainbow SRX. And basically it is a air cleaner and a cleaning system. And it is water-based. So So there's no bag. There's no bag. There's no filters. Your filter is that. Simply water. It's just water. It's a little plastic container of water. So I'll just show you, it's just a, con a container and there's a little bit of water in there Yeah. and it's clear water. I mean, you can see there's it's, that's tap water. It's just I tap just water. Took that out of the sink or out of the faucet. I need to that sink. <laughs> took it out of the faucet. So slide this in. Now, just like this, if I turn it on, it's going to clean the air. It's going to suck air in the front and it's going to push clean air out the back and it's going to use the water to clean the air. And I can turn that on at four different speeds. It's really loud. I'm going to turn it on for a second. Well, let's explain too. How does that clean the air? How is, can you, can you tell us that? Do you remember how that's cleaning the air? Because you just said it's, you turn it on, it sucks the air in and it pushes it out and it's clean. Yeah. That's how it cleans the air. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it creates a little, it, it, it creates a little hurricane in there. Um, so it creates a little miniature hurricane, uh, and it put, it brings the air into that hurricane. The, the water will grab anything that's in the air. So any pollutants that are in the air, any little dust or, or whatever that's any floating particle. in the air, anything that gets brought in, the water's going to catch it and it can't fly away. It's then wet. It's just going to sit in the water and what comes out is clean air. So it cleans the air. Right. Pretty cool. Uh, so here's what it sounds like. It's loud, but we also have... There's four settings. Four speeds. So that's pretty cool, okay? And I don't know if you want to get a shot if we go back up. Yeah. Can you zoom in down on the hurricane? That's spinning it up in there. So that's the air cleaner portion of it. You put this in a room and you let it run. You put it on the main floor, you let it run. Um, you know, we're told that it can clean a room in like 10 minutes yeah. on speed four. I don't know. We're, we're playing around with how quickly it works in the house and everything. So we'll, we'll let other people who know what they're talking about tell you that stuff. <laughs> so the cool part, the vacuuming part, uh, we're going to do a little demonstration for you guys. We have not vacuumed this room yet. Okay, um, Jen vacuumed the master bedroom and uh, it was kind of disgusting. So we thought, you know what, let's do a video of this and let's let's show our friends, our family and, and other people what we think of this tool and how it cleans. So we're going to vacuum with the Kirby. Like he normally would. Yep, just like I normally would. And then we're going to vacuum the same area again with the rainbow. And this is just to demonstrate what the Kirby's picking up versus what the rainbow's picking up after the Kirby's done. Yep. Okay? So this little doodad, I don't know, goes on like this, I think. Ah! So that clips onto the front. We'll move that over there. We'll do the Kirby first. We'll just do 
doing the standard two or three passes. <coughs> That's what people normally do. <coughs> I'm starting to cough because there's stuff already coming up in the air. It's, it's the is throwing the stuff in the air. <coughs> It's not just for show, guys. Coughing because there's stuff in the air. <laughs> okay, so we just did this whole section with the Kirby. Should be clean. Yep. Shouldn't be too bad. Should be pretty, pretty, pretty clean at this Should point. Should be pretty clean. We're gonna do the same thing with the rainbow. All people like you. Sure. We'll go with that. I think she's hinting that I'm going to back you more often. I don't know why I like that idea. Alright. Is that good? Sure. Check it out. Yep. But keep in mind, we just vacuumed Kirby, and now we vacuumed Rainbow over the same section. Just to see if there's more that it can still pick up. We're gonna pull the water out. That's what the water looks like. And what is that floating around in there? That's disgusting. There's like a big hair blob ball. of hairball. I think we got a cat. It's something. Yuck. So you guys so, can see that. So Kirby already picked up everything it was gonna pick up, and now we've got, and if we were to vacuum this longer, I guarantee you we would see more of that yeah. in here because I did this to our bedroom just a little bit ago and it was like, yeah, keep in mind, there was, was a big gross yeah, hairball in there. I, I just vacuumed for 15 seconds. I did not go over this in a great amount of detail. I certainly didn't vacuum as well as we would for the first time through a room after we just moved into this house. So it, it's picking stuff up that the Kirby's leaving behind. It cleans the air. It does, it does an awesome job. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> yes. So, and this, if you want to, can you hold that up for me so that I can see? Because this was clear water, guys, and you yeah, saw this before. This is, this it is, was clear water. You look underneath it. This it is, this no is nasty. It's, and that was just a couple of swipes back and forth. Yeah. And if we were to keep going, I'm sure was, we would get it more. It was worse out of the master bedroom. Um, it's going to be worse in high traffic areas. It, this thing picks up way more than the Kirby does, hands down. Uh, yeah. We're getting rid of our Kirby. Yeah, because this, I mean, and you don't, there's no, there's no smell. When this thing is cleaning, in fact, if anything, it smells clean. It doesn't smell, there's no yeah, dust. It's, it's, it's not it's kicking up air. more stuff. It's just fresher. Yeah, because anything that blows through it is has already been cleaned. So what it mm -hmm. blows through, it's not blowing dust out the back. And now we've got kids running kids in. Kids screaming. Okay, we dealt with the kids. <laughs> sort of. Didn't not, deal with the kids. Not, not exactly. <laughs> <laughs> the controller okay. was turning off. Okay, so we anyway. got we got stuff to deal with, but yeah. we wanted to show this to you guys because it is quite a um, it's a it's, it's a it's, cool system. It's a really cool system, and and we do have. Uh, oh. Are we switching? Okay, <laughs> switch camera. <laughs> she's just she has no I'm idea doing. what she's filming. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, we do have what's called a Rainmate. It's a little mini air cleaner that goes with this. It's their other product that they, that Rainbow has. Uh, we have one of those as well. We're going to include a link that if you guys want to see this unit, um, they operate a lot like other facilities of high-end cleaning systems. So they will bring somebody into your house to show you this system if you are interested in it. Uh, I think it's an amazing demo. It's, it's awesome to have them come in. And, and just go through the science behind it, go through all the information in it. And it, it, for those of you who know me, I, I ask logical questions and, and I, I try to call out any kind of, eh, that's salesy. Uh, and I did with Christy as well, uh, and she was great about it. And she was able to answer all my questions. So the, there is a lot of technology behind this. It does an amazing job. Um, we, we like it. And I'm hoping 
<laughs> not just hoping, I'm pretty confident we're not going to need an air exchanger yeah. once we go through this entire house and clean everything with this thing. And then just maintenance. Yeah. I don't think we're going to need the air exchange. And we've only had this thing for a couple of days. I'm already coughing less than I have been. Yeah. Because I had been coughing, even the day that Christy came in to show me this unit, was, I had been coughing, coughing all morning long. And yeah. all, the entire time while she was here or whatnot, until we were running this thing regularly, I, I've been coughing and coughing and coughing and coughing. Yeah. My allergies have been horrible here. Yeah. And it's just because, I mean, there were other animals here. It's an older house. It wasn't as clean as the other one that we had lived in before. So yeah, this thing, now that it's running, I actually come in and I just, it's, I don't cough as much. There's not as much flowing through the air for me to be breathing in. So it is fantastic, especially for anybody who has allergies. It is allergy yeah. certified. Yep. And I highly recommend it for anybody who wants one, a clean house and clean air. So I guess that's two things. That's two things. Two and big things. To, it kind of replaces... A couple, I mean, it's, we used to have another air purifier, too, that we would run. That's in storage. I don't think that's coming out. Yeah, I don't think that, because that has to be, like, up in the air. And I never really felt like it was doing a whole lot. The filter was constantly clogged up. Right. The it was just. Exactly. It was that's the problem clogged. with air cleaners. With the filters, filters get clogged. You have to you have to continue to clean the filter. With this, you just change the water. Right. You don't have to change it that often. No, we so, do. We we chose to because when you get done when you're cleaning the floors and whatnot, the more you do it, the less stuff you'll be picking up. But in the beginning, you pick up so much, so much stuff. It's really gross. And so we got um, we do strain it so yeah. that when we dump out the water, we're not because we pretty much just put it down the toilet. But you just you like we strain, strain it, it so the water goes the, in the toilet, and then the, we take we the, throw all the gunk away. Yeah, yeah, the yeah gunk, we just, we throw just throw that in the trash. garbage. So, but we're going to include a link with, with this video. You guys can see it in the description below and on the post, probably wherever we post it. But there's going to be a link that you can reach out to Rainbow and say, hey, I want to, I want to see this. Yeah. Um, you should just, just, just check it out. See what this thing is about and see how yeah. much it could possibly help your. If your... nothing else, just see their website. They have a ton of yeah. information on it. Uh, seriously, guys, uh, it is not often Jen and I will. Like endorse something and say you guys need this. Um, but it's only been a few days, and I really appreciate having yeah. this thing running and cleaning up the air and the ability to really deep clean. Because if you can't get to the source of the problem, which for us is all of the stuff that's in the floor, and yeah. every time we're walking, every time the dog walks your on the bed, carpet, you're kicking it up your in floor, your bed. Your, it's everywhere. Yeah, it's, it's everywhere. everywhere. So if you have allergies or whatnot, I I mean I can't I can't speak for this thing highly enough. Yep. So check it out, guys. See the link. Uh, yep. And let us know your thoughts. Seriously, we want to hear back from you. Yeah. Check See you guys. Out. See ya.